live from Austin. And back in the studio. Breathe easy, friends, because it's going to be a great night. Hey, everybody, keep it going, because here are your hosts, Brian Rushwood and Justin Robert Young. All right, all right. Game hey, number one. Hey, Game hey, number one. Hey, 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 hey This is hey, called the hey, Aerosmith hey, Challenge. Hey, hey, you, hey. Grab, you grab the mic, okay. and then you lean it forward. Then you lean it forward. Then you lean it forward. Then you do a dance. Okay, do a dance. dance. Walk do a around. dance. We're walking around. Back, so you don't now we're going back. Tangle in the cord. And we're probably actually tangling them. Oh, no. Oh, God. Okay. Anyway, that was the dance. Did I win the challenge? You did. You're now the lead singer of Aerosmith. Ay, 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 ay! Well, I, I, sorry. I, I, I don't know if I was clear. Now that you're the leader, you don't have to do an impression of the former lead singer. I can Aerosmith. do whatever I want. Yes. So, so now is the time where you decide what the new voice of Aerosmith sounds like. Why don't you give us a little bit of walk this way in the new voice officially per the game, the new voice of Aerosmith. Just, just, just let it out. You all right? Hey, walk this way. <laughs> Talk this way. Walk this way. Talk this way. Just give me a kiss, okay. love. I, 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 I mean, you're the one in charge. Nobody can dispute your authority. I'm the new Aerosmith. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe no it, one can be Aerosmith but me. Exactly. So yes. I can do whatever I want. This is official. I the, checked it with the podcast. The responsible of the constable world. is the new voice of Aerosmith. Okay. All right. Do me a favor. Just give me a little bit of dream on. Dream on. <laughs> <laughs> true morn Dream until your dreams come true, love Okay Alright Just for fun Give me a, 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 a Give me a walk this way But with Run DMC <laughs> <laughs> Walk this way <laughs> Talk this way yeah. Walk this way Yeah. Talk this way Right Okay, now do my Adidas. My Adidas. See now, see, yeah, 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 you got washed out. Uh, that that's a Run DMC only. Fuck. Yeah, no, Aerosmith wasn't in that one. Damn. Yeah. I do we have a constellation up. prize? Brad? I just want a million photoshops of uh, of you as Liv Tyler in a constable hat. From the 90s Aerosmith videos. You know what? Actually, I'm, I'm on board. I, yeah. I support your opinion. Let's do that. Everybody get that. Is Liv Tyler related to that Tyler? What yes. the fuck did you just say? <laughs> and were you dead? St- were you, are you willing to hold up a pinky? Because I didn't know Liv Tyler and Steven Is Tyler it? were related. Yeah. <laughs> no, those videos were intensely creepy. <laughs> I was, I, I was born in 1990. It's I the don't Tyler know. Bell. Yeah, it's we're the, ringing yeah. the Tyler Bell. Oh no, not the no, Tyler no, Bell. no. Yeah, uh, no, Bryce. That for real. Uh, uh, oh, he was her father, and then it there, still is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> At the point that the videos were made, got his ass. That's our got new, his ass, Brian. Sorry, Good guys. Boy. This is our new. This is our new character, <laughs> pedantic Pete. Get him. Get him, Pete. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, it, when, when those videos are made, uh, their career got resuscitated in part because of Walk This Way, and then like randomly they became like the biggest rock act in the world. Yeah, in it was the like uh, there was like a ten year stretch. I think uh, Walk This Way was Run DMC around 1984, and then there was um, uh, cry, uh, cry, uh, Crying. Yeah, well, no, there, there was like, two, one, like yeah. all of a sudden, randomly, they just became Alicia Silverstone was in them I and, think. and Liv Tyler. Yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah. they were like, it was just they figured, how can we do videos that young that? kids would give a shit about that involve a bunch of then old men in Aerosmith? They were old then, and it was like, oh, I don't know, put hot young chicks in it, and somebody was like, I don't know, Steven's got a daughter. Yeah, that's that's fucked up that uh, uh, an entertainer would involve his daughters 
If you put your daughters in the positions that he put his daughters, actually, I, we I, would have room for conversation. Your Honor, I withdraw my <laughs> objection. I was gonna say, how much do you remember those videos? Yeah, I know. I, I, I remember I them vividly. <laughs> <laughs> they were vivid parts of my Lividly. my. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Hey Bryce, we have a topic. We do. We've been live. How long ago was that again? Oh. I mean, I guess for us, it was... 10, 10 days? 10 days. But for people who are listening to us in the free feed, it was just this last was week. the last week. Yeah. 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 Man, I, I, I had forgotten how long that was. Uh, I guess let's go chronologically. Bryce, how was it to... Um, in my mind, I would imagine that you finally felt like you were able to punch your fist into the heart of every uh, uh, trivia person you've ever been frustrated <laughs> with and and assume their soul like like no you guys still had to do the show afterwards so <laughs> yeah yeah we're no, them we're do, them do you judge you everybody who it. does pub trivia now no it was uh, it was fun so i did the opening act i did we did about 35 minutes or so of, of pub trivia uh before and that isn't posted anywhere right did we record that uh we recorded it but i i i kind of I, I don't know I, 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 a little bit loosey-goosey a little loosey. bit copy, actually right? wait, hold on for further comment let's go back to bryce you <laughs> know <laughs> and now for the deleted scenes <laughs> uh line <laughs> er, er, uh Anyway, uh, so yeah, so you did uh, you did trivia to, oh, yeah. to warm everybody up, and I kind of feel like it really set the exact right vibe. Everybody was loving it. It was it was really fun. I uh, my I've I've been I've write I've written games and puzzles and trivia a lot uh, for various shows. Right, I do a trivia almost every week here, and uh, I go right. with the pub trivia. Look, and all. Like we have, we're all here together because we love you. I don't need you. Bringing up all the other people you do the train. <laughs> no, it's just, it's uh, uh, it was it was neat because it was uh very similar to the stuff that we, I already do, but then uh, I don't know. I was very unstructured when I went into it. I kind of went into it very unstructured. Uh, Wait a minute. It, and are, was, are, 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 are you are you worried about your uh, how how everything your went? prowess? Uh, you had, did you did you have performance anxiety? I did, especially at the beginning. Uh, I was definitely sweating a lot <laughs> the first like fifteen minutes. Really? Um, uh, and uh, so much so that I left the stage while the music was playing to go get napkins to to, to mop it, it up. It was hot up there. It was hot up there. It was hot up there. Um, oh yeah, how would we know? <laughs> well, because we were in the corner, you guys were right on the stage. Yeah, who, you guys could walk who around. Who won, by the way? Uh, somebody. Is it trivia? Uh, it was oh, oh, these boys. Some of our folks e. who are K. in the studio. E.K., Doug, and Alex. Yeah, E.K., Doug, and Alex. And their fourth. And so fourth. you guys. What was your, your name? Not in front of Wallace. Not in front of Wallace. That's yeah. pretty good. And so you guys uh, uh, now know where Bryce actually goes to trivia. Because you got the card that that is uh, 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 applicable to it. Let me share. Since somebody needs to come up here. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Somebody get on a mic. Yeah, go, go over here, over there. We have mics everywhere. There you go. All right. T tell what happened. By all means, take the mic that's already being used. Uh, well, no. Okay. It's, it's fine. He's just speaking one thing. Uh, well, no, I just... Um, Talk into the mic. <laughs> into the mic. Uh, uh, it was me, EK, Doug, and a fourth guy who I can't remember his name. Uh, uh, I, I think it was Logan. Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Logan, wow, nice. great guy. Our, our our friend from Torchies. Oh yeah, yeah. 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 We, found um, out the place. we found out the place, but we gave the gift card to Logan, and I can't remember what the place was called. <laughs> so, so now that's been lost to history. Lo only Logan knows. Damn. Yep. No, this no. is like the end of the first Indiana no. Jones. Yep. Uh, uh, it's just in a warehouse where no one's ever gonna find it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That that tracks. Except that are, warehouse is Logan. Are you are you <laughs> as sad as I am that apparently the latest one is not doing really well in the reviews? I I got an extensive, oh no, almost scene by scene review of it oh. from a friend of ours. That probably was better than actually watching the show. Uh, 
Can, uh, it's can, it's Stinko Malenko. Can can we speculative spoiler talk? Because I'm I am as of this moment, I'm not going to go see it. I don't. That f- it feels I don't know. Maybe like all I time know travel. Is, this. is time travel in it? Yes. Okay. Great. Yes. Uh, at the end, do they time travel? Yes. Okay. Do they retcon? No. Hitler. Hitler's involved. Yep. Is he retconned? Uh, he's black now. Ah. Uh. Yeah, <laughs> Man, that's why he finds the Ark of the Covenant, doesn't he? No, it has nothing to do with any of the previous movies. Whoa. I mean, except for the fact that Hitler's involved because Hitler was involved. In- oh my God, does he create the Hellraiser box? No, oh. you are thinking of cooler shit <laughs> <laughs> than happens in this movie. How fucking dope would that be? <laughs> no, there was a million different things, including the fact that it's like because I was I was talking to a friend, our, our friend, and uh, there's a fake out in the movie that uh, uh, would put I won't say which main character, but would uh, 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 they request that they're going to stay behind in the past. Uh, and then they're not allowed, right? Yeah. But I was like, well, if you were going to keep this, because Harrison Ford doesn't want to do these movies no more, right? And he's getting well, fucking he old. Wanna, he appears to not want to do anything, anything anymore. right? Yeah. And by the way, nor should he. Except for crash planes on, on golf courses. Well, he likes shrinking, though. And Just, be amazed yeah. by David Blaine. He's like, uh, he's like, what about this? What if I was amazed by David Blaine? You, 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 you want to hear my impression of... Uh, Harrison Ford accepting every acting role over the last 25 years? Only if I can tee you up by being Callista Flockhart. Okay, yeah. Harrison, what would you like to do, sweetie? <laughs> That's not... That's not. <laughs> No, because it's a, it's a one you thing. You have to offer I him a gift. I can't say multiple words. I was okay. gonna, it was okay. a one. Okay. Okay. It was a one word impression. No, so I'll, you I'll, can... do it. I'll do it again. <clears throat> yes, of course we want more syndication. Hold on. Harrison, listen. I'm sorry. Your agent's on the phone. You only have one word. Are you in or are you out? <laughs> Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, did I steal your... I did no, the thing. No, you I did just said another punchline. This <laughs> is your own punchline. I I, 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 what part of the build-up to that? <laughs> Rise next time. No, we all, we all got it. It was good. It was good. Brett's gut busters. I didn't get to do my impression. What was the impression? Moving on. I thought the impression was the bong hit. No, I was... There was going to be a punctuation that was building up to the empty space. You know what? But you just yelled another punchline. Okay, well, luckily, I didn't show this, but I have a little something. I call it a dial of destiny. Hold on. Let me see it. It's, it's a token for the chicken ranch. Yeah, I just want to see it. Okay. Go ahead, bro. <laughs> Uh, Brett. Yes. So uh, from the show also. Yes. You have a story? Yes. We just said I you do. Uh, it, this is going to go along the lines of the show from Friday where we had a whole first uh, bit, which or a whole thing where we talked about am I the asshole? Yes. Mm. So oh, yeah, that, that was, was our game. Our yes. game live on stage was am I the asshole? We had Judge Heaton. It was a really fun time. Yep. As as uh, to continue with that a little bit, uh, I went to Louisiana this weekend to visit family, and what I want to know is, am I the asshole mm-hmm. because I made my cousin who just had a quadruple bypass bust a stitch? Ooh. Okay, a stitch. Where's the stitch is is my first question. Along his chest. The outside yes. of his body. Okay. Yes. His okay. own stitch. Yes. yes. Not his not so, because like 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 talking him into busting somebody else's stitch would be pretty dope. No, but that would be weird for me to be encouraging my cousin to do that. that was it like in a... time? Because and it did could... it's <laughs> oh, damn it. Unbelievable. 
unbelievable. I, I, I only have one other challenge get, coin get in you, my pocket. Yeah, this is like when you take I'm a give you this one too. I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I need a dial of destiny. This is like when a ma when you take two magnets that are both positive and Say you like, try to wham, squish them together. Wham, wham, wham. And we've talked about this. It's 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 bad. I'm bad. I'm bad. I'm a bad person. Bad to the bone. Brett, what happened? <laughs> so, what happened was uh, 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 my my cousin had just got done with surgery. We went down to see him. How long uh, ago? When when was the surgery done? Uh, uh, four three weeks ago. Four weeks ago, okay, kind of, kind of fresh. Yeah, and the uh, so uh, quadruple bypass. They removed stents. It was everything. Everything was there. Uh, he did recover. He's in recovery right now. But uh, when I visit him, here's the thing: I have a very specific relationship with my cousin. I threatened him as he was coming out of surgery and he was awake, and I said, you know. I'm going to come over there and I'm going to make you laugh so hard. You're going to bust a stitch. You promised him that. I promised that I was coming. To Promise do that. is a fancy word for a threat. Yep. Yeah. So my sister, my sweet sister, uh, uh, and my other, and his sister, my uh, cousin, and my other cousin came over. We were all over at the place and talked. And the whole day was a wonderfully beautiful nice time with cousins we're all very tight uh conversations happen i was actually pretty much the listener for most of it except occasionally when i could just drop in little sure. jokes and yeah kind of like what i do here sometimes sure mm -hmm. uh and so it came to a point where we were talking about weed as you do yeah when you're my age and uh uh at, and those who know me know that i am not a big partaker. You're not a weedo. I'm not. Now my cousin, who's just recovering. Sorry, real, real quick. Is weedo a thing? Mm -hmm. Yep. You ain't like, never heard like, it. Like, like an otaku or. Well, I don't know if it's in that in that uh, realm, but yeah, no, it's like um, if you were to ask, um, what's his name, if they smoke weed. <laughs> Hey, Blink. No, no, no. The guy with the mustache. You know, memory loss is uh, Hitler. No, 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 no. The one with the uh, the overalls. <laughs> our our friend Matt Donnelly. No, 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 no. no. The one uh, uh, he's got the brother. They jump through the pipes. Oh, an Italian. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If you were to ask him. Uh huh. You're the weed. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on, Brett. That's 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 stretching that bit, and that was fantastic. No, it doesn't no. matter no. how long you make the racial joke; you still made it a racial joke. <laughs> yeah. No, no, I think it does Let matter. Let ethnic storytellers tell ethnic stories. Sure. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gatekeeping. Uh, so it, it, we were winding. Down. I can tell it because I'm Japanese. <laughs> 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 so it, we were coming down to it and talking about it, and I surprised him to let him know that I had one time taken an edible. And this was a story that I've told before, mm. uh, but he had never heard it. And it's basically uh, took a chill, what's called a chill pill. And uh, uh, and when once I took it, I realized I wasn't feeling well. So I went and laid down. Uh, my cat jumped on my chest. I petted the cat. Really wasn't feeling good. Got up, went to the bathroom, dry heave, threw up kind of thing. Walked out and go, man, I still don't feel that great. I'm going to go lay down again. And then I proceeded to tell that same group of over and over and over again to show that I was in a time loop. Yeah. And he laughed so hard as I was getting at to where he started coughing and he was holding his chest. And you would think my sweet Baptist sister and Catholic uh, cousin would be horrified by this. No. No, they were encouraging me on because this is the nature of the relationship of our of our family to where to where he just had such a great time and he had a little bit of had a little bit of blood right there. <laughs> so, uh, sweet Baptist scissor. Uh, so, whoops, scissor. Wow, that's a different, Paging Doctor Fury. Totally story, bro. Oh. 
trending Not right now <laughs> on the hub. I, I thought it was gonna sweet like Baptist a, scissor. In my mind, right. it was gonna be ninety-five percent like, upvotes. <laughs> I thought there was going to be a karaoke track. It was all going to be like. And then somebody would say. No. No. <laughs> 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 But you're doing the intro, so you're <laughs> pimping me to do the entire first verse. Who knows how long it'll go? <laughs> Brett, move on. Okay. <laughs> it ended up being a great time. What happened first? Did he feel it, or did they find the blood first? No, we found the blood afterwards. After after the laughter that turned. Brett, to stop! <laughs> it's not even the same amount of syllables. <laughs> it's like you're asking me, like. Like a, a sweet home Alabama, right. sweet Baptist scissor. Not the not same the amount same. of syllable. Not, not even scissor. See, you fell into the same trap I did, sister. <laughs> oh, I thought I was going to do the funnier version. But you said. Nah. Don't do the funnier version. Great, great story, bro. <laughs> I think we're fucked. I, th I think we hit a... Yeah. Yeah. Does anybody do have a go-kart? Do you see card? now... Why I wanted to not do it. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Okay. My eyeballs are challenge coins that you threw away. <laughs> Brett. Right. I mean. Did he have to go to the hospital? He did not have to go to the hospital. What do you do? So happened, it just so happened that my cousin-in-law, who is my cousin's husband, is a nurse, and it was all fine, and we just checked it, but it was... It was all good. Yeah, he's all good. It, I had a but, situation like that once. I was uh, dating a girl who had a uh, uh, irregular heartbeat at times, and so she took medication and everything for it. But every once in a while, she would feel it, and it would kind of freak her out, and she had to sort of calm herself down because her anxiety made it worse. And I was a younger man at the time. <laughs> and not to say that I've matured much more, but... In the face of awkwardness, my natural instinct was to make jokes. Yeah. And so in other situations where she was feeling kind of like not great, I would make jokes and would usually cheer her up. But in this case, she was trying to calm down her regular heartbeat. Oh. And so I was trying to do a thing for which I don't know that I had done to that point in my life, which is very seriously and very earnestly calm somebody down without trying to diffuse the tension with jokes. And boy, did I hit the edge of that sorry uh, <laughs> thing enough times where she's like, stop making jokes because I'm laughing at them. And you're worsening my irregular heartbeat to the point where we might need to call an ambulance. That's much, much better than I had feared. Because in my mind, you're going to be like, oh, your heartbeat is off. Here we go. Heartbeat. Heartbeat. Motherfucking heartbeat. Heartbeat. Motherfucking and heartbeat. And seven, eight time. And eight, 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 eight. That would have been worse. Yeah. That would have yeah. been. Bryce, next topic. Girl dinner and boy dinner. You guys want to get on the new trend? Yeah. Hot new trend on TikTok. Girl dinner and boy dinner. What do you think they are? Girl dinner is a bottle of red. Boy dinner is a six pack of Miller Lite. Mm. The two of them begin to talk but end up in a fight. Uh, I I think it, it's one of them classic battle of the sexes kind of things that uh, has surprisingly endured through our modern Gen Z lens. And girl dinner is something extraordinarily fancy. There's a candelabra. There's 14 different plates. And boy dinner is something hilariously low key, like uh, people eating out of dog dishes. I, the boy dinner almost certainly is just going to pull a random example, hypothetically. Uh, it's going to be 
uh, Hormel uh, microwave dinner with uh, maybe a bit of Cheetos and Fritos sprinkled on top, maybe around 11.30 at night, maybe involving an argument with your 15-year-old daughter. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just throwing that out there. Anything else? Any other? Anything else to wash it down? Well, uh, maybe Dad, please, the man. Oh, the man. Wow. <laughs> the man. Uh, maybe, the man. Maybe he the pleads man. for her to watch the third episode of Detroiters. I'm just throwing that out there. While uh, uh, with uh, utensils or hands uh, eating the Hormel. Man, uh, my vision only extends so far. Gotcha. Gotcha. So how'd it go? Did she watch? We're on episode two. Okay. <laughs> so okay, okay, good guesses. Brett, did you get a did you get a guess in? Uh, oh, oh, can I? Yes. You, uh, you know what? I I allow you to have a guess. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I would say, is there a difference between girl dinner and boy dinner? Yes. Hmm. I would say that the difference is Brie girl dinner. <laughs> has I never I had never been it. to a dude's house where Brie was served. Brie. Never. Brie. It, that, that is exclusively a girl thing. Mm. I, I'm I'm the wrong generation. So, uh, girl dinner is vegetables. Boy dinner is meat. That's oh. okay. Well, That's an even more okay. archaic. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can, we, uh, can we take a moment here? Yeah. Uh, 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 what, uh, what kind of meat? Beef. Yeah. I mean, it is what's for yeah. dinner, but, but, but like cooked or raw. Or? Sure. Sure. I, you know, acts like that. That's a good tartar. Yeah. Yeah. Tartar. Yeah. Uh, you want to uh, come over uh, to my house? Uh, We're gonna have a boy dinner. <laughs> Where that sounds. <laughs> you, know, you, you started. All right. You landed. Come on over. <laughs> okay. We're having a boy dinner tonight. Listen, Brent. we all, me and all the me and all the fellas are coming over, and we're gonna have a. Just a feast for the boys. Brett, I, I really appreciate you coming with me. He keeps on asking. I've never been here before. I, I, I really appreciate you being here. Uh, We're here for your boy dinner. <laughs> Welcome in. Sit on my chuck wagon stools. <laughs> uh, okie okay, doke. Okay, here we go. Yeah. It's a uh, first course. <laughs> grit. <laughs> Just what? Nope. <laughs> the idea. Uh, oh, oh, you you mean like being a, a hardened against Slap. adversity? <laughs> oh, 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 I want to leave, but I'm gonna stay here and show my grit. Grit. Yeah. Course two. Don't show off. Slap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Now that I think meta, about it. meta is emasculating. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure that you keep all lessons only within your head. Brett, help me. I, I kind of enjoy watching him slap. Course three, <laughs> slap Brett. <laughs> oh, <laughs> spoke too soon. Always be there for your fellow man. <laughs> yeah. Course four, couscous. <laughs> it's a family recipe. <laughs> But not grits. Okay. <laughs> this is quite delicious. Course uh, five, the end of the bit. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot I was showing you something here. How uh, close did we get? Well, let's uh, show you uh, <laughs> one of one. This is one of the more popular girl dinner videos here on TikTok. This is my meal. I call this girl dinner. Girl, girl, dinner. girl dinner. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. That looks like beef. Yeah, so that was girl dinner being so it's it's so it's a flip, right? Yeah, uh, uh, it is a, a, a girl having white wine, rolling herself a J, and then trying in vain to open up a pepperoni case, oh, Italian dry salami, dry salumi. Uh, uh, so so that is girl dinner. So th the thing that I was thinking was boy dinner. Turns out it's girl dinner. Boy, <laughs> it's Gen Z. What are they going to think of next? I mean, I, I, not for nothing, as I was watching that, I thought, we're not so different, us and them. I know. <laughs> I know. But it raises the question. The What's existence a of a girl dinner necessitates a boy dinner, mm. Bryce. Mm -hmm. That's right. Uh, well, here's one for you. You know, the boy's got to have one, too. Get, get here, Give it to the boy. 
how that song goes. Here it is. This is my meal. I call this boy dinner. Oh, oh Jesus. No longer. So it is I'm, underneath. I'm no longer comfortable with this underneath bit. a mat. Or sorry, a, a, a comforter. Uh, he lifts the comforter. There is old pizza uh, that is all but eaten, and an open ranch container. He puts the pizza into the ranch container and then eats it. Uh, so it's just vile fucking food shit. Is that uh, oh, also? Yeah. But by the way, I will say reinforcing the gender stereotype that boys are grosser than girls because while the girl was ironically a mess a white wine glass a, a joint and salami far cleaner and more hygienic than old pizza that is kept under a cup oh, i'm sorry you mean the perfect food pizza all food, all the food groups, the pizza. Number one, Bryce, you don't have to show off that you're not into the girl dinner. Like, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> you've lost your power, motherfucker. <laughs> you don't have to. I mean, like, we're we, ten days in. Like, we get it. <laughs> stop, stop shoving it down our throats. <laughs> oh my God, no, Dude, no, hypocrite. You hypocrite. don't get to revert. Hypocrite. You don't suddenly become more hypocrite. powerful because we're eleven days into July. Hypocrite. <laughs> you know you're, you're a hypocrite. Where was that? that? Was that off air that we were talking about yes. white people? White people keep, keep using the phrase "shove it down our throats" <laughs> yeah. when it comes to gay stuff, or or bent uh, bent bent over a barrel by the bank and so on. No, 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 no. Specifically, when people are talking about culture war stuff, mm -hmm. and they're like. Oh, well, like, I'm fine with gays, but just don't shove it down our throats. <laughs> yeah. It's like, I mean, you would have thought at some point somebody would have been like, hey, man, I'm, I'm, I'm on your side. They should keep to themselves. But stop saying the evocative phrase <laughs> that is immediately brings violent oral sex to mind. <laughs> Maybe, like, I don't know. Maybe I should become a homophobe so I can go to the meeting and just note them. <laughs> just, hey. Hey, note. quick note, guys. Quick note. Yeah. Quick note. I'm on, I'm on the side. Let's I, subjugate him. But can we give one quick note? I, 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 I think you meant wait, uh, subjugate or con conjugate? Subjugate. Like the straights are subjugating the gays okay. into, into a I, into I a rather minority. like the idea that they're having a ling linguistic discussion about conjugating all of the uh, uh, bending, bender, bended, yeah. and mm -hmm. all that stuff. Bryce. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go on to our next stuff. <laughs> Let's pitch a movie. Oh, the show is ripe for long form improv, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> My favorite part is that Yuri Geller's gonna have to watch all this shit. <laughs> Hi, Yuri. <laughs> we can go. We have one other one. Fuck no. no. Let's go all fucking. No, we're night going. Long. We're going all in. Yeah. Uh -oh. We're going all in. You watched a movie, huh? Uh. It featured Idris Elba. Oh shit! Uh, Hijack. It's a TV show. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's yeah, a, yeah. a television show. Yeah. yeah. The fuck? Here's the twist. What if? Wait, hold on. Can we do the premise before the twist? I think he's going to, because the pre the premise is, is the, the twist. twist. Okay. The twist is a guy tries to explain the premise, and two people <laughs> squeeze him out of his own bed. <laughs> You want to know what? I earned that one. <laughs> the, the, I, w I was owed a receipt. The, the, uh, 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 I was an accessory after the fact. Hijack is, is way, way good. Uh, good. I've only seen one episode so far, but um, uh, it, 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 the twist, I guess, there, or the, uh, I don't know, the, the top spin, uh, uh, is that it, it's a flight originating out of Dubai, but all of the hijackers are uh, uh, classically diverse in a non-Arab way, uh, and that's as far as I've gotten. Pretty good so far. Are they like? Ch oh, are they? They're they're white people. Yep. But so, also one's black, mm -mm. and one's a girl. So okay. they're like like United Benetton of terrorists, except for one checkbox. I've only been one episode. No, in. no Arabs. I mean, the only 
Arab, who is a major character, is the guy who's like, it's like in the first episode, he's like, hello, hello, plane, are you sure you're okay? And they're all like, we're in terrible danger. And he's like, well, hold on. And he's like, and they're like, psych, everything is fine. And the Arab guy at Dubai is like, are you 100% sure of that? And they're all like, yes, we sure are. Goodbye. Goodbye. Click. And, and they're like, end like, of episode there's one. No, there's no clicking that happens on this. And they're like, no, it's 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 We're a great show. I, 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 but, but but Idris Elba of Idris Elba fame is uh, the main character, right? Yeah, he's like a fixer. the The first forty five minutes of this movie are nothing. The show, but it's, it's, it's pretty much movie. It's so good. Uh, it's <laughs> nothing but Idris Elba. His dialogue just says like people do things, and then it says, I assume in the script it says Idris Elba looks at them. <laughs> Other yeah. people do things. Idris Elba looks at them. And it's just that for 45 minutes. He's good at looking. And I'm here for all of it. it he might also amazing. be good looking, but he is specifically good, good at, at looking. looking. Yep. Yeah. Because that was like some of the best shit in The Wire was him just like just looking at a motherfucker. Well, that and also like chewing out the rest of the gang for taking notes during... You're taking notes during a <laughs> goddamn criminal conspiracy? Yes, exactly. How, how far in are you, Bryce? Uh, I think I finished the second episode. Um, I think there's only three out now. Uh, it's good. It's very good. Uh, I don't want to say more than that because it's like a thriller and it's kind of a bummer that like the premise of the show is the twist, so it kind of whatever but that the they're end. not arab is the twist no i i don't know why brian didn't say the thing that i thought was the twist oh. uh, uh go ahead well so idris elba's on this plane and the hijackers are like hey we're gonna hijack the plane now uh and idris elba's like hey i'm gonna get back to my family so i'm gonna help you hijack this plane <laughs> because y'all clearly don't know what you're doing <laughs> and so you think like oh he's gonna stop them but actually he's Maybe helping them, but is he? I don't know. Oh, uh, so there, there, there's a little will they, won't they yeah. of, of the criminal conspiracy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good. Yep. Is he in on it? Is he not? I I didn't really think about that until just now. I, are, there, are, there, are there flashbacks? No. Everything's in the moment. Yes. So someone's going to be like, like, I remember you. Dubai, that Jamal... It, like we're all friends and he's gonna be like yeah 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 and then all of a sudden you're gonna see over his shoulder as he's writing in his diary anyway i killed jamal last this is, night <laughs> this is actually shockingly close i i, I want to stop this talking. is why i this should is, be pitching yes. shows <laughs> where, where is this uh, apple tv plus on apple tv plus <laughs> this shit is easy i can fucking spit this out all right here we go uh brett you name a famous actor that everybody would know Right and uh, uh, Brian, you name a a, a a a conflict like just any kind of a, a, a conflict that that that, yep, that person yep, would yep, have. Yep, Keep yep. one in your mind. Yep. And Bryce, yeah. you name a place anywhere in the world. The more exotic and exciting, the better. Uh, Brett, you first. Will Wheaton, someone people know. <laughs> An actually famous person. Yeah, come on. Okay. Uh, what is this? Attack of the show? Come Brian, on. Let's Brian fucking Cranston. do a star. Brian Cranston. Brian Cranston. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, I need. I need a a a a conflict. The thing I know. Conflict. The, yeah, yeah, like. All right, listen up, people. We are five minutes away from the world's most popular live game TV show being broadcast live. In five minutes. Also, I'm Glenn Close. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Live. Wait, no, no. But something has to be going wrong. So that, that is the setting. Because I asked, we asked, are I asked, sure I asked, I asked the Bryce. The broadcast equipment is working. And we have been guaranteed that there are 17 fail safes. And there's no way all 17 will fail. Okay, again, oh, so I'm Glenn setting, Close. Again, we understand it's Glenn Close. Uh, 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 but we're going we're gonna to skip that ahead and say it fails. That's the conflict. And the conflict is he has to... All right, whatever. Yeah, I'll, I'll move with it. And, and, and Bryce, 
Uh, Brian already kind of did the setting, but yeah. let, but let, 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 let's twist the setting however you want. Oh, but it's uh, it's on the island of of Madagascar, <gasps> okay. and and they have to survive in the game as well. All right. Uh, so Brian Cranston mm -hmm. is what you initially think is the host of the biggest live game show ever. Glenn, Co Glenn Close is the producer. What you find out by the end of the first episode is that this is just a kidnapped group of American celebrities by a warlord in Africa who has flown everybody. And now they have to pretend that this is all happening. And the only way that they can figure out a way to escape is by Glenn Close saying, oh my God, everything failed and hope that the moment of blackout is their time to escape that happens for the first time in episode four but they get caught uh they then have to do the one big finale uh, uh to to figure it out and then as the big revelation at the end of this uh season one is happening because everything has to be a series yeah. uh 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 cranston has to fake a heart attack but you don't know whether or not he's actually dead until like right before the credits when he like winks at Glenn Close. Love it. Just have one little, if, if, if I may float it out there, feel free to knock it down. A little bit of a, of a plussing on here. Mm -hmm. What if we maybe hint at who this warlord is? Okay. It's, it's in Madagascar, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. So all of a sudden, like all the music leading up to it is in the same key, but then at the key moment, it goes like, then you hear like a off key minor key child's chorus going, I like to move and move it. I like to move and move it. I like to move and move it. And then they reveal the warlord is that whatever dude king of the island from the movie Madagascar. He's like, move it! Your regal is watching this. I like the movie, movie. I like the movie, movie. You don't even say the words right. No? What? No wrong From ideas. What? Him. Have you not seen Madagascar? No. What? But you know, there that was Matt one kid? person in the room who was very into the bit I was doing, which is why I doubled down on it. You don't All know right. that. Uh, you don't know that. Real to reels, I like to move it is the theme song for the Madagascar franchise, Justin. And that there is a literal warlord of Madagascar in Madagascar. No. Well, <laughs> let's get you together in the writers' I like room. To move it, move it. I'm like familiar to with the song. Like yeah. To move it, move it. Do we want to do another round or, or just move on? I don't know. I'm kind of into this. Okay. Uh, uh, you do the celebrity. Bryce, you do the conflict. And Brett, you do the setting. Uh, Brian, who is the celebrity? Ed Harris. Ed Harris. Oh, that's a good one. Ed Harris has range. Uh, uh, Bryce? Uh, he's, uh, he's not sure if he's a robot or a human being. Oh, we're going sci-fi. It's sci a little high concept. Oh. Uh, and uh, what, g give us the setting. What's your name? It's the futuristic Philippines. <laughs> <laughs> it's you the future got. with the P. You got got. You went back for a second bite, <laughs> and now Brett just set you up to fail. Go ahead. Futuristic Philippines with Ed Harris, who doesn't know if he's a robot or not. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Ed Harris is a butler <laughs> in a futuristic home of the leading government officials of a Philippines that has surpassed China for the greatest power in the entire Asian world. I love it. Uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, turmoil that is happening. Uh, most of this is a, a political drama, uh, but Ed Harris is somebody that is uh, uh, either trusted or not trusted by the various different people. That's actually kind of like a, a metaphor for how you know how advanced the civilizations are. 
that are coming to to visit all, all the different uh, uh, various people uh, uh, from it. <laughs> What's happening? I'm being Ed Harris about to be a butler. Oh, gotcha. Oh, yeah, yeah. You are, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 I'm listening to you. <laughs> and as there is a gigantic treaty that is about to be announced, one that would uh, uh, bring an Asian federation with, with, with the Philippines at the head uh, in this far future, the premier of China deeply despises robots. And while the Filipinos believe that he is a robot, they're trying to convince him birdcage style that he's not one. And they're trying to program him into believing it. And so we start to find out that that's the actual story through like halfway through. Mm -hmm. uh, and then eventually it all culminates in the final moments before uh, uh, the, the signing. Uh, Ed Harris is revealed to be a robot. Ladies and gentlemen, season one starting on Amazon Prime. <laughs> Ed Harris is Peen dot O. <laughs> <laughs> I can't decide what my favorite. Fucking easy. Yeah. This is easy. I can do this all goddamn day. <laughs> I don't know if my favorite part is that you Bring got me Ed Harris. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh... Are you a robot? M Mr. President, I, of course, am never a robot. I'm, a I'm, I'm, I'm the eyes. Filipino president of Asia. Yes. <laughs> now, as you know... Uh, We're tall now. <laughs> <laughs> That's also how you know it's the future. Yep. We got tall as shit. Mr. President, as, as you we know... We have robot whites. <laughs> That's fucking amazing. <laughs> We are fucking balling. <laughs> uh, 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 Mr. President. Yeah. Have you ever seen the birdcage? Yeah. You know, it's uh, the one with all the animals. They're in Africa. You know, they go to the island. The one sings, I like to move it, move it. <laughs> I, I think that's Madagascar. That's not the birdcage? No, no. The birdcage is... Uh... No, 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 no. It's the other one where all the same characters from the first thing I talked about have advanced a little bit, but they want more money from children. Uh, I, I, I think that's... Terminated that's Madagascar too. Yeah, oh, yeah, no, yeah. that's... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 no, yeah, the birdcage. The birdcage. Which one's that? I... Uh, you know what? Uh, it's the one where we convince everyone I'm not a robot. Oh. Oh. The gay one. <laughs> I like to you move it, move <laughs> it. I like to move it, move it. All right. <laughs> it's half fading. Ed Harris. Uh, I've actually been listening to some Amazon originals that are narrated by Ed Harris. Uh, they're quite good. They're like one hour short stories of like, uh, uh, I don't know, crime noir stories. Can you do an Ed Harris impression now? Of course I can. Like what? <clears throat> Tell, here, here, narrate the noir version of the show I just pitched. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> well, okay. The author, just, just to set the tone yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, sure. The, yeah. the, the author is very minimalist like he he doesn't give details on sure. purpose oh, okay yeah. Oh, or, or, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah an audible original old blue eyes nobody knew where blue eyes came from they just knew that he showed up at the local diner he had four coffees and always asked to touch the girl's ass didn't matter if there was a girl or not that's why they called him Blue Eyes. Nobody knew why they called him Blue Eyes. <laughs> he might have been a robot. <laughs> Stop it. No, I'm buying it. I'm buying it. Yeah. Oh, Blue Eyes. Oh, Blue Eyes. Starting, debuting next year on a a Apple TV. Let's fucking go. Why are we pitching TV shows? <laughs> this shit is gold. Bryce, what's the next topic? Uh, our last topic. 
Salsa or pico? Yeah. I want to say this is an intervention, but... Uh, I've been making salsa. Yeah, have you? Salsa fresca. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Brett. Yeah. Yeah. Describe salsa versus pico. Uh, salsa tends to be more of a cooked maybe sauce type situation with a combination of tomatoes pepper mm, onions mm. garlic well this is great but bryce, bryce just bryce just uh, googled salsa sure so brian based on your fucked up definition how many of these that immediately come up to the definition of salsa are you going to say are salsa i'd say 60 percent of them appear to be tomato sauce with spicy bits in them and that is what different from pico and what is okay? So pico is pico de what, gallo. What you can, there we go, as they say in French. Uh, uh, pico de gallo would be what? Oh, more like what we're seeing right now, which is what you serve, which is quite good, and I love it very much. But chopped up tomatoes, onions, onions jalapenos, yep. cilantro, maybe some serrano peppers. Maybe if we're getting wild, like so. You would say salsa, different than that. That is more of a a salsa. Sauce. Sa salsa is like, like tomato sauce here. with shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like uh, one of those seems like pico. The other one seems like salsa. That's yeah. That's pretty much it. Yeah, that's the end of the the end of the the, the round. Yeah, the end of the genre. Wait, 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 wait. where do you set your? Uh, welcome to my new bit. Set your slider, slider, yeah. slider. Yeah. I'm Ed Harris, old <laughs> blue eyes. Who uh, prefers salsa? Who prefers pico? So uh, I actually think of them more in the genre that you would eat it. Like if you are mostly just going at this motherfucker with tortilla chips and you were trying to eat it directly, yeah. then salsa fresca would be something that would have more of the same flavor profile of the kind of salsa that you're talking about, but would be chunkier. And so basically you are taking out some of the blending and maybe even some of the simmering. I, I didn't from... know that salsa fresca was a different category. That's what I make. Yeah. Uh, and that would be more of using the fresh ingredients and less of the super blending or super like simmering kind of stuff uh, 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 uh the rest of the panel uh, uh what uh, how is that different from pico uh, you gotta have a you gotta have a, a salsa is is there's there's it's it means sauce there should be a saucy element to it yes how do you how do you respond to, to accusations that your so-called salsa mm -hmm. is short of salsa <laughs> <laughs> I want you to have an interview show. <laughs> uh, uh, so yes, it is. It is definitely not sauce in the way that barbecue sauce is sauce, right? Uh, but it probably is sauce in the way that soy sauce is sauce, in, in that it has a watery consistency with a flavor profile to it. It just has chunks in it. Are the chunks swimming in something we heard? Yeah. Well, I mean, now I, tomorrow or next week, I'll bring my salsa in and everybody can eat it. Can you can determine have, whether can, or not can, it's salsa. Can, 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 can we all bring a wonderful thing to dip chips in and we can not reveal until we all consume it whether we all think they're salsa or pico? Yeah, I mean, we'll so taste I make test it mean is, yeah. pico. Oh, right. you're gonna. You also want to bring so a you salsa. Also, no, that no, just sounds like you want to go head to head right. with my salsa with extra steps. That's fine. We can have a blind taste test challenge and see who makes the best. Wait, but I wanted to argue about whether it's salsa. Or pico. Nah, but did you? Uh, but did you? I don't really want to argue. Because you already had time. mine, and yeah. you know what you make. I don't no. know what you make. What you and made... you were like, hey, Justin, you're gonna bring yours. Can I bring mine? So that's fine. Just Dude. say that you want to challenge me to a <laughs> salsa slash pico off, she and off. we can do it next week. I just don't know if if I am fundamentally misunderstanding those terms. That's that's the big thing because right, to, to I be, very much enjoyed your what I perceive as pico. Yes. I, I, to be to be fair, I think the only real thing that 
changes the definition in my mind is that Pico goes on other stuff and is not necessarily a, a dipping a table dipping thing. Ooh, that is a good So you definition. put pico on fajitas, you put pico on on tacos, and to be honest, if I were making pico, I'd probably make the exact same shit that I make that is salsa on the table, but it's more of a functional definition than it is a pico is an additive whereas salsa is a dipping. A dipping thing. Got it. I, yes. I, 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 Bryce, I've got some information here that maybe will be enlightening. Uh, I asked Google, or someone asked Google, and uh, Google says pico de gallo is made with raw fresh ingredients, while salsa is typically and made with mostly cooked ingredients. There's yeah. a cook. It's, it is the uh, cooked, uncooked delineation. Now, 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 now go ahead and, and Google salsa fresca. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Yeah, oh, here we go. Because wow. that is what I make. I it's salsa see. fresca. Yeah. It's made uh -huh. with fresca. That's like, I, 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 to be honest, I'm a little bit uncomfortable with the level of tension in the room right now, especially knowing that Yuri Geller's watching this. I know. I know. Uh, here we go. It. What is the difference between salsa and salsa fresca? Uh, this is from our friends at muydelish.com. Pico mm. de gallo or salsa fresca. There we oh, go. Damn. Is made with raw, fresh ingredients versus salsa made typically with cooked ingredients. Jeez. I piss on you. You win. Shit. I shit on your fart. I fart on your piss. <laughs> we, we are friends, friends again. again. Hey! hey. Uh, uh, competition next week? Yeah, wait, wait, wait. You know what? Let's all do a fake competition where we all go to H-E-B and show up with the same shit. But <laughs> the question is, how are we going to afford it? Because we're broke as hell. I know, Brian, we are. That's why you all need to save us by going to patreon.com slash great night. At patreon.com slash great night, we have over 5,000 years of ancient history That's that true. has been categorized lovingly by the hands of old Greek women. If you love that kind of shit, psych, we don't have it. <laughs> but we do have a way that you can give us money. Patreon.com slash great night. Allows a world class experience in giving us money. Put your credit card into a website and it will take money for us. And also, you get the bones. And, uh, uh wait, a minute. hold on. Uh, our, our, our feed is being interrupted oh. by an evil genius. <laughs> Hello, it is I. Decision changer. Decision changer, what are you doing here in our feed? I have decided that not enough people understand how good the bones are. What? That's very generous of you to say. Thank you. That is a really kind of nice, subtle compliment. What Thank are you. the bones, said I, Bryce? I, for <laughs> <laughs> I formed a calculation <laughs> matrix and decided the only way for you to all understand how good the bones are is to force feed you bones. Now, I have a dial right now in my hand. I can set it to minimum pain in which you listen to only the first five minutes and it fades out in 20 seconds, or I can set it to maximum pain in which you listen to exactly half of the episode and it fades out over the next eight minutes and 24 seconds. What, how shall I set it? I ask the void because there are no other characters in this scene. <laughs> I think I was in the scene. Who are you? <laughs> I think I was Bryce. Okay, <laughs> Bryce, yeah. where shall I set this pain matrix? I um, will force free bonus episodes on people. Uh, and I will torture them with the amount of time that it takes to fade out in the middle of the conversation yeah uh well i mean i'm i'm against pain i'm like against pain but my gut tells me that there's a commercial interest in sorry, it sorry, sorry. Pain. pain or paying yeah i mean i guess, well, I guess both the one have it, uh, <laughs> the other, right? <laughs> I mean, we all know you steal everything what the heck? <laughs> I, uh, uh, as the beginning i will be gentle I am I the decision Fuck maker? Fuck you, pain maker, <laughs> said Bryce. Uh, uh, we'll never have any pain. I dare you, you piece of shit, to do the maximum amount of pain, said Bryce. 
Uh, uh, okay, I will begin with a maximum amount of pain. 25 minutes of free bonus content, but nine minutes of slow fade out is coming to you on Thursday. I'm Decision Changer. No, Goodbye. you piece of shit. No! This is the worst thing that could happen, said Bryce. Uh, so, is that your calendars? Yeah. Buy your plane or tickets? get your own RSS feed. The fucking get 90% all of it. chance we forget. <laughs> I wrote it down as if I thought that would help anything. <laughs> 99% chance we forget. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Now's a good time to get on the RSS train. I will say, yeah, no, shit's really good. The bones are bones, great. Bones are fucking it's, really it's, funny. Uh, 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 we get into some of our most interesting conversations. Uh, it is super relaxed, super chill, and uh, every single Thursday. Let's see. Uh, Bryce, we got a game? Uh, we do have a game. I got a new game for us today. It's called Gaga or Ha Ha. I swear to God, if the first question is, what did we just agree to? <laughs> <laughs> that, uh... <laughs> no, oh. no, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Okay. Uh, no, okay. I shan't, I shan't dare. No, this is a game called Gaga or Ha Ha. Woo. Woo. Uh, I have went uh, uh, across the internet and found a bunch of quotes from the Joker and one Lady Gaga. You're going to tell me who said it, the Joker or Gaga. Ha Ha or Gaga. Um, that's pretty simple. Uh, uh, but can you beat me? The, the two of you will have to beat my... Rid my challenge of undetermined length. Well, uh... Oh, are we playing together, or...? Oh, yeah. I, yeah, why yeah. don't you play together? All right, I've, good. I've, I've, yeah. I'm already dressed up as Robin. And I'm already dressed up as Katy Perry? Yep. <laughs> you know what? I like where this is going. Yeah. Yep, okay. <laughs> Trying to think of the um, the Robin equivalent to, <laughs> to, to Lady, Lady Gaga. Gaga. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, so I'll give you a line here, and uh, you just got to tell me uh, who said it. Brett, do you mind keeping score? Uh, what? I'm sorry? Do you mind keeping score? <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fuck. Oh, hold on. Actually, you know what? I get full credit because if you watch the visual version, the fact that it cut to a gigantic scoreboard <laughs> and Brett not understanding the question <laughs> was chef's kiss. That yeah. was so good. I set it all up, and then I'm like, what am I doing? You just keep this. You only keep, it's only one score you need to keep. I even. would love to keep that score. Thank you so much, Brett. All right, we got your first one here. Who said it? Gaga or Ha Ha? The, the quote is... Smile because it confuses people. Is this a Lady Gaga lyric or a line from the I got you. I feel Joker. like I got a I, I got a beat on this. Okay, all right, go this ahead. This is Bryce trying to trying to fuck on us real quick. Fuck I, I think, on us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not with with, a, with this thing, yeah. <laughs> Not around smile us. because it confuses people. That's very Gaga. Yeah. That ain't that ain't Joker. Yeah, no. Uh, jo Joker's uh, unironic. Joker's like. Like not like oh there's there's a thing I'm trying to do it's like smile because the world is great like 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 that's that's there's more no Joker. deeper point no no yeah. no he's he is the the consummate comic anarchist where, who believes where, everything if, if it was being sung by Lady Gaga it would sound yeah. like smile because it confuses people yep I'm with you yeah good job good job Joker. Are, are, are we falling in love? I, I shouldn't have picked Robin. No, God damn it. No, no, no. But Robin doesn't fall in love with Lady Gaga, does he? Or Joker. Does or, Joker or fall jo in love with jo Robin? No, uh, well, I, I, no, he kills Barbara Gordon in, in the killing joke, doesn't he? Does he? Just, Is that a spoiler? <laughs> well, that's the killing. That's like an old comic. Okay. Where like it, it ends with him and Batman laughing, but you don't know if they're jerking each other off. It's a thing. It's a thing? Yeah. You, you, that's that's the most not a thing thing you can just say it's a thing Go about. Go look at that frame. No. Look at that final frame in the that, killing you know joke. What? Actually, press a pause on this game, Bryce. I'm sorry. <laughs> We're going to need you to look at that no. final frame and look at the confusing no. ending and, and entertain the possibility that they're She's either paralyzed. She's paralyzed. Or, yeah. Kind of looks like they're jerking each other off. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh... Here, uh, I think this is it. Here we go. Uh, no, it's them. There's one gigantic big... does look like... Yeah, no, that's it. Yeah, that's the frame where they're laughing together. 
as he's kind of like holding the shoulders, but not really. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. The and neck. then they keep laughing. And they keep. And laughing. then there's a bunch of water on the ground. <laughs> yeah. I think that Air that might be around come. water. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Okay. All right. Uh, so I'm 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 with you, Katy Perry. Oh, we're holding on to that. Okay. Yes, <laughs> I'm with you too, Robin. Thank you. All right. What and what is your answer one more time for the judges? Gaga. You're gonna say Gaga. Gaga. We were looking for. Ha ha! That was Joker. That was from The Dark Knight. Fuck. Whoops. Oops. Katy Perry, I I don't think we're doing a terribly good job of this game. Me neither, Robin. Maybe we should change characters. Get away. Here, let's <laughs> both walk away and come back as different characters. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Clip, 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 clip. Hi, who are you? Hiya, Mr. J. <laughs> no? No, I'm Katy Perry. <laughs> <laughs> I decided I didn't want to change. Now I'm stuck with this voice. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. I'm looking forward to your new we'll movie. Be right back. No, no, no. Come back. Come back. Hey, Bryce, what's the next question? All right, our next one. Fuck is... you, Justin. <laughs> I'm Katy Perry. Don't be an asshole. One by one, they'll hear my call. One by one, they'll hear my call. That what? sounds like Mr. J. You think so? Yes. Me too. But on the other hand. <laughs> I think it might sound like Lady Gaga. That sounds like a lyric that Lady Gaga, my friend as a fellow pop star, because I'm Katy Perry, uh, 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 would, would would sing. I think it's Lady Gaga. What oh, do you, oh, jeepers. Why do you think it's Joker? Because, be, because he slipped me this note saying that whatever I say, I should obey his commands saying it's Joker. Mm. Why is that? Well, because I used to be a psychologist, and then he confused me, and now I'm a supervillain, Mr. Miss Miss K. You don't say. Yeah, uh, I, this is the extent of my knowledge about. <laughs> Go on. I forgot the name of my character, Harley <laughs> Quinn. <laughs> That's fascinating. Give me more of that. <laughs> Can I, can I just maybe come back and Sid Caesar's? Hey, uh, wait, hold on. Wait, okay. wait, wait, wait. Just give me a monologue. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. We, we're settled. It's the Joker. You're going to say, one by one, they'll hear my call is the Joker. And your answer is... The Joker! Hey! That's from anyway, Batman. Anyway, I've got to become another character. Goodbye. Bye. That was from Batman, the man who laughs. Mmm. I'm still Katy Perry. Who are you? Vanilla Ice. <laughs> <laughs> it was. They said they said they ran out of everyone was booked. What was uh, your favorite part of? Posing in Madonna's sex book. The part where she surprised me and didn't tell me that she was going to publish our sex photos. That was uh, that was a fun bit. Yeah. That being in Cool as Eyes. Also having the number one hip-hop album of all time. Also, my HGTV original show yeah. in which I fixed up houses. Also, the new metal phase I went through where I played Ice Ice Baby. In fact, uh, uh, DJ... Can you play me playing a bit of me doing Ice Ice, uh, Cold as Ice, whatever the song was? <laughs> it's me, Vanilla Ice. Uh, <laughs> even, even if I could, I would need something here. I would need um, an amount of time. Ice, ice cold. Do you remember eating lunches at the Broward Mall to the point that you became local legend with kids who grew up in West Broward? Oh, yeah, but mostly I remember the fact that Ice Ice Baby was a B-side to play that funky music, White Boy, which was one of my singles when I was in Dallas. I don't know if you know this, but I grew up as a fairly middle-class uh, kid. What's your last name? Van Winkle, mm -hmm. what's yours? That sounds like some shit that, you know, would be a upper middle class kid in Dallas's name. I, 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 so far, oh, I've been my last name, yeah, Perry. Right, remember this? 
Yeah, I did an interview. Yeah, do you remember this? People that God was a time traveling wizard. That's another true fact about me. Vanilla Ice. I I just realized how did much you vanilla eat at, ice. Did you eat at the Chick Fil A or at the Japanese place at the Broward Mall when you fucking ate at the Broward Mall to the point that you became local legend and kids would time when they would go see the very sad Vanilla Ice who was at that point just kind of a home renovator, just sitting there with paint on his fucking hands, eating weird chicken from the... I'm testing you where you ate. Uh, Chick-fil-A. No, it's the Japanese place. Moving on. Uh, The time I remember the most is when I was eating at Stubbs Barbecue in Austin, Texas, shortly after my performance on the smaller of the two stages. I looked over my shoulder and... Two guys, a magician and a comedian, were on stage breaking world records. I was jealous of them at that moment. Sounds fucked up. I, are, I'm are, Katy Perry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Bryce, Robert, what's I'm the next Robert question? Sam Winkle. All right. All right. Uh, here's uh, our third quote. Is this Gaga or Ha Ha? We got... I try to sell myself, but I am really laughing. That's got to be Gaga. I think these are all jokers. He did literally say, are they jokers or is it a Gaga? I think I think he gave away himself and there's only one Gaga. I Joker, think we're locking Joker, it Joker, in. Joker, Joker. You're locking in Joker. Yep. This answer is from Art Pop Lady Gaga. Hey. I'm going to leave. I'm a bad character. He outfoxed us once again. Uh, it's just me, Katy Perry. Hi, Katy. Hi. I Bryce. like some of your music. I have a residency in Vegas. Oh, I would. I. I don't think I'll ever be able to afford to go see that. But don't uh, worry, one day you will. Oh, that's uh, that's sweet. In fact, I'm gonna call your boss, Brian Brushwood, and tell him that if he's any kind of a man, he needs to pay for Bryce to come see me in concert. <laughs> The next time in I'm in residency at Resorts World, the same room where he saw David Blaine try to kill himself. <laughs> That's yeah, it. We'll, that, we'll that, that, that room has two purposes. <laughs> Having me with rotating candy cone breasts yeah. and David Blaine in a bizarre ritual of self-destruction for money and glory. I think I might be able to make that happen. Lady Gaga! <laughs> okay. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I'm going to leave now. <laughs> <laughs> Brett, what is our score, by the way, while we figure the out? The score is, the score, you know, the score is quite funny. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's, it, it's, they got one the <laughs> answer wrong, and they got two answers right. <laughs> Is that right? That's not right. That's not it's right. It's the other way. They got yeah. two we wrong. We got two wrong and one right. Uh, is that right? Yes. Yeah. Jesus but the camera flips Christ. it, so you, it, it kind of does. Okay. It's it, fine. Price, it. next question. All right, our next one. The quote is, his mask is his real face. Is that a gaga or a ha-ha? I, I would assume a Gaga. Uh, no, it might be a Joker. Yeah, I, I think this is eighty nine Joker. Let's go Joker. You're gonna go with Joker. Yeah. I'm also. Uh, hello, my name is Commissioner Gordon. I have oh, a very I, neutral way of speaking. Hi, Commissioner Gordon. I'm Katy Perry, internationally known pop star. <laughs> it's uh, just wild how you're nailing it. Yeah, I'm on American Idol. How are you? You ever see that? It's on ABC now. It used to be, or sorry, yeah, it used to be on Fox. Now it's on ABC. On ABC. Is it? Really? Yeah. Wow. yeah. Wow. I mean, I'm, a, I'm with Lionel Richie and a country man. Is it, uh, wait, are, 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 no, you're thinking of The Voice. Nope. That's on NBC. Maybe I'm thinking of The Voice. No, yeah. The Voice is another country man and, uh, <laughs> and then usually a lady singer and then usually a hip hop okay, man. Okay, all right. No, yeah. That makes sense now. Yeah. Which one of us is the masked one? <laughs> Lauren? No, that's the masked singer. Yeah. That one has. The dude who said gay boys on uh, Hangover and hey boys. Jenny McCarthy and uh, another one. <laughs> I think a pussycat doll. Okay. Yeah. I think that's those are the ones on them. Pop quiz. Who am I? Commissioner Gordon. Yep. Nailed it. I must be doing a good impression. 
This is okay. Uh, <laughs> his mask is his real face. Is the quote? What is your answer, gentlemen? No, it's it's got to be the jokes. Yeah, yeah. Joker. Then Joker. Also, also, uh, do do you happen to I'm know Joker? Do, I'm Joker. <laughs> do you happen to know which which iteration of the Batman's, if it happens to be a Joker, or which iteration of the Gaga's it is? Well, uh. Just like in the previous questions, I'm going to tell you where this one is from because this one is from Arkham Asylum. It's Joker. Yeah. Finally, Katy Perry and Commissioner Gordon, the power couple that everyone always lusted for. Yeah, well, here we are. Uh, yep. Let's let's do more of these. Let's solve let's crimes. Let's do it. Solve We're crimes. solving K question K crimes. K uh, Katy and the G Man. What's your what's what what's uh, your favorite song of mine? Commissioner uh, Gordon. Uh, oh my gosh, uh, Piano Man. <laughs> I didn't do that one. That's Billy Joel. Yeah, I'm waiting for it. What do you think? Come on, you can name one of my songs. I'm Katy Perry. The one where all. you're a tiger. <laughs> and that song is. Hooray. What would a tiger do? Because you're gonna hear me. Roar. Yeah. Okay. That's one of my favorites. I think I did that at the Super Bowl. Did. Did I even get that right? You did. I'm, yeah, okay, yeah. well, I'm yeah, surprised, you you right? I'm yeah. sorry. I'm I'm a, I'm a middle-aged Don't be so don't be so nervous. Okay, look, are we starting it's just me. Yeah, Katie yeah I'm feeling it too. No, yeah. yeah. There's a real erotic tension building. Okay. <laughs> Bryce, go ahead. <laughs> All right. Your next quote. Paint your face and paint her face. Paint your face and paint her face. Gaga. Gaga. That's got that's Gogs. That's got Gogs written all over it. I think it's look, about Bukaki. Here, uh, uh, take, take, take a look. If if you do a forensic examination, click, click. It's it's Gaga. It yeah. says here like uh, click only only this lyric click. has written by Lady Gaga on it. Click click. Yeah, wow. When you look at the evidence that you're <laughs> clicking through, yeah. it's very very clear. You know, a lot of people think that I need some kind of like crimed cape fighting. No, guy, no, but I no. Don't. Just put your arm out again. Uh, okay. Click, 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 yep. click. Okay. Yeah. Oh my wow. God. The evidence only becomes clearer the more you click. <laughs> well, let click. me click a little bit yeah. more. Click, uh, click. Okay. I'm gonna click a little bit slow now. Clear. Okay, now I'm gonna speed it up. Click, 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 click. I'm gonna slow down. Clear. I'm gonna straight. Now, now you tell me. Do you want me to speed up or slow down? Oh, I think, I think, I think, I think you should, I think you should speed up. How do you feel about? It? Uh, uh, real quick legal question. How do you feel about terms click, of click, service? Click, 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 click. Take that, Yuri Giller. All right. Yeah, whatever we said. Uh, Gaga. You're gonna say Gaga. Paint your face and paint her face is. It's Lady Gaga. From the Psychic. song from Swine. Yeah. You know that song, Swine? There we go. I knew that. Yeah. I'm Katy Perry. Oh man, what's your favorite track on Swine? What's well, a track? It, it, Swine's a song, isn't it? Yeah. Swine's a yeah. song. <laughs> so, I know that because I'm Katy Perry. I'm in the music industry. You might yeah, not have known that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm Commissioner Gordon. I'm bigger in the solving of crime. In the not solving so of crime thing, you're not good. Understanding this the difference is... between tracks and albums. See, that's, that's the I'm thing. A little it's, bit weaker on that We're strong one. together because we've got both sides covered. Different. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> solving okay. crimes and pop music. Yeah. Forensic details. That's my beat. We're cop and rock. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Bryce definitely no, said it. No, there's yeah. like let it sit. Three people to get it. <laughs> I rarely on but this program do we get a really triple hard. veto from everybody else. <laughs> <laughs> All three of you motherfuckers are like, nope. Mm -mm. nope. That was Botchko, right? Yep. Yeah. What? Lasted like four yeah. episodes. I can't. Three episodes. Cop rock. Cop rock, baby. Cop Google rock. it. Oh, have you not oh, seen yes. Cockro? Oh my God! He admitted. <laughs> We're doing a game. Okay, no, I don't. I don't. It's, it's it was a show. It, it, was, a show. it was a famously shitty show back when people gave a fuck Before about television NYPD things was. failing. Ah, uh, like imagine Glee but with cops. Yep, the Brooklyn Nine Nine. Nope. Oh no! Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I got some crones on that one. Yeah, right. no, 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 just because they sing four times an episode. 
like like and the oh wait oh, really for real yeah, oh, yeah, no, yeah, actually yeah. Uh, we're pressing pause on the episode Bryce we want to experience you experiencing cop rock do us a favor just go to YouTube type in cop rock we already have applause from the audience this is gonna be amazing okay uh, you're gonna have to give me a second here. that's fine what, there we go what should I look oh, hi I'm Katie Perry oh hey I'm Commissioner Gordon listen and up, we're kids. here for life alert cop, if cop you, rock um, <laughs> Not even once. Not even once for Cop Rock. All right, this is uh, Baby Merchant. Baby Merchant. Uh, Bryce, uh, audio listeners, when Bryce is just very, very, very confused. <laughs> and now the tilted head of a, of a golden retriever. <laughs> That's, <laughs> it's a movie, but it's got the feeling of an awful commercial. Uh, uh, it, it was a primetime television TV show. What? It looks like a fucking McDLT commercial. <laughs> yeah. oh, it's awful. Yeah. Uh, imagine cops doing cop things and bad guys. Do, it's pretty much the wire, but looks like that. Yeah. Oh my god! And this goes. Look, I'm just skipping through this, and it's just these same <laughs> shots of yep. them by this palm tree looking at each other. Oh! <laughs> yep. Wow. Why it only happened? Now, if y'all watch shit episodes. like that during Court Killers, you wouldn't be doing it for two years at a time. <laughs> <laughs> Instead, we're watching Miami Vice, which I know. is pretty good yeah, for the fourth that. consecutive year. Yeah, well, we haven't been. <laughs> we're on the fourth season. Yeah. Well, we're on the fourth season, but we're not watching. But we haven't been watching it for. We've been four doing years. the show for fifteen years. That's uh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, 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 all right. Uh, what did we say here? Did we do something? Oh, we did. It's oh, up here's to you. Me. Riddle me this. Riddle me this. Is this Gaga or Haha? Ha? Here's a quote for you. Uh, we could be anything you want. We could be jokers. You want to try it on for size? You're the singer. Like, just, just if it were a song. We could be anything you want. We could be jokers. Okay. Now you do it as the joker. Oh, we could be anything you want. <laughs> we could be jokers. Yeah, it could be either one. <laughs> Can be <laughs> one. It's a real, Shit. it's a real yeah. Schrodinger's Joker here. All right, we're gonna go Joker. Yeah, yeah, Joker. You're going Joker. Lock it in. They're locking in Joker. We were looking for Lady Gaga. That's from her song Enigma. Well, that's not real. We could be Jokers for only one day. Not familiar with that one. Bryce, next. Our next one here. I feel like I know you. I've been watching you forever. That's got to be. That's jokes. That's jokes. Like yeah. The only way to get creepier is to say every breath you take. And that's. At nobody some point, would put Bryce is going to throw the okie doke, I feel like. The, I'm sorry? He's going to give it a, a flip you. Flip you for real. Is the okie doke a wrestling move? No. That's the <laughs> kind of thing that Bryce does. <laughs> when, you think when, you know where it's going, and then whoop. And it's called the okie doke. Whoop. <laughs> I feel like I'm learning so much. Yeah. Okay. Hey, yeah, you're not, you're, not uh, you, you're, you're a fucking commissioner. Commissioner. Yeah. You're, you're a police commissioner. You're not used to fucking people like this trying to pull okie dokes on you. I, I'm not. you were the whoop. Look, can I confess something? Yeah. I think my daughter might be Batgirl. <laughs> she the one in the wheelchair? <laughs> what are you trying to okie doke me? <laughs> All right, Bryce, we made our pick. Do you remember what we said? <laughs> <laughs> we were looking for whoop. <laughs> Turns out. <laughs> He gave you the okie doke. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Katy Perry, <laughs> you just got okie doke. I hate it. to be the scorekeeper right now. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> no, that was uh, that was a line from Joker from the movie Joker. Oh. We're gonna say you didn't even answer that one, so that would not be a point. Whoop! <laughs> whoop! There's your whoop. <laughs> we just both got double okie doke. We did. Brett, what's the score going into our final round? The final round, actually, if, if we... Uh, they got that last one wrong. Huh? They got that last one wrong. Okay. So, so two go. points. So they got four wrong. I'll get in the microphone, please. Three right. Uh, one more time. Four wrong and three right. There we go. Thank you so much, Brett. How are you I guys feel feeling? good about this crime-solving duo. I think that we're... That crime's not going to exist after <laughs> we're done with it. <laughs> Everyone's gonna be abiding we're gonna, the law. We're gonna give everyone just the old whoop. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's time. This is that classic Katy Perry catchphrase that everyone knows. That's how I ended the Super Bowl. <laughs> okay, oh. you got it from me. Coming at you like a dark horse. Whoop. <laughs> I love. I remember that. And then when Left Shark was also oh, God doing, damn it, you beat me to Left Shark. God damn it! Ah. Are you ready for? Ready for? Whoop! Whoop. <laughs> <laughs> A perfect storm. Perfect storm. Whoop! Whoop! <laughs> All right, it's time for our final round here. This one's for five points. Ooh, it's still anybody's whoa. game. Maybe you'll win. Maybe you'll lose. How you feeling? Loose. I'm, 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 I'm feeling like we're getting the old okie doke. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Well. Uh, uh, you think he's saving it? You think I'm? He's holding... saving this one for for the for when it matters most. The real the real fucking trickster Hall of Mirrors. This guy. Right, Bryce. If you change the rules on us, we're gonna watch all of Cop Rock. Uh, no, I won't be changing any rules. We'll just be doing the game to, okay. to complete. So he right. says. So he says. Go ahead. Play your game, Rogue. What's the question? Okay, uh, here is the line. Who was it that pulled the trigger? Was it you or I? I think that is from the killing joke, and I think that's a joker. I think that's actually the line that he says to Commissioner Gordon, or no, to Batman when he has shot Barbara Gordon. Just in case. I'm a I'm a big comics fan. <laughs> I'm just Katy Perry. Just in case, try it on as if you were singing it. Wait, me or Gaga? Because I'm Katy Perry, but we're doing this for yeah, Gaga. Man, I, I think you could do it. We have very imitation. distinct singing styles. In yeah. fact, the fact that you thought that we have a similar singing style is really breaking up this no, 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 no. buddy I, romance I think you're of ours. You're a talented musician, and I believe uh, you could manufacture. That's why you well, never well, here, date for example, pigs. here's Jesus. here's uh, uh, here's. <laughs> Here's uh, here's uh, Ray Stevens doing this line. Okay. <clears throat> Who was it that pulled the trigger? Was it you or I? See, I, if I could do that, you, Katy Perry, talented musician, could do the Lady Gaga. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Who was it that pulled the trigger? Was it you or I? Wow. Man, now that you do it that way, I'm, I'm starting to think Gaga. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Just kidding. It's Joker from a very it's famous Joker, comic It's book. Joker. Yeah. yeah. All right. Your answer of Joker <laughs> is incorrect. Oh! It's a Lady Gaga lyric. Oh! If we were so incorrect, how do you explain this prediction? He's, he's gone off stage. around. He's looking for his. He's looking on his phone. Tip his phone. Okay. How do you explain this? How do we? Hold on. He's okay. We're holding on. It's hard to open it. What was the right answer? It was uh, Lady Gaga was the correct answer. Look at that. Can you confirm that's been in your hands this entire time? He said, fuck me. Why am I doing this? I'm Commissioner Gordon. I'm so <laughs> sad. I ate a boy dinner last night. It was half-eaten pizza <laughs> on the floor. <laughs> and I dipped the ranch hey, That might into be the, the wrong pizza. file. Wait, it should be and labeled prediction. When I ate it, is I was recording it for TikTok. And I said, oh, is this for me? Or is this for the world? Yeah, yeah. Sadness envelops Gordon. 
And it's only through sadness that I can become Gordon. <laughs> My dick hurts because I've been jerking off this too much. Swear to God, are you tweeting right now? No, I'm reading your diary. Oh, it says Gaga. There, there it is. Whoop! <laughs> <laughs> all right, and uh, Brett, we need to do all the math here. How was their answer? Answers were. Loser, because there were Talking nine about. correct. Uh, mm. They got nine wrong answers. Yeah, and three right answers. Boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop, Get dunked on, on, nerds. It's been an honor to serve with you. I have some news for you. Oh my god, I wasn't Katy Perry this whole time. Oh my god, I always thought it. No, I was a figment of your imagination. <laughs> And here I am again, on my own, <laughs> going down the only road I have ever known. <laughs> like a drifter, I was born to walk alone. Hey. But I made up my mind. I ain't wasting no more time. <laughs> I'm Commissioner Gordon, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Just back it up your monologue. <laughs> All right, stop what you're doing because I'm about to uh, rule. No, you no, 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 that's fine. Uh, Keep it low. It doesn't, you don't need to. You don't need to blow it up. You know, so, it's, it's fine. Uh, so, Calm it down. Okay. It can sometimes end on a down note. <clears throat> it can sometimes. Uh, 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 just hey, need a little bit uh, of background uh, music. Uh, Brett, put uh, me now I was trying to do the woos. You didn't want the woos. Oh no, no, no. I want, I want the woos. Brett, what have we learned? We've learned many things tonight, Justin. We've learned Pico de Gallo, Salsa Fresca. Fuck it, just give me the taco. Yeah. Right? Two, we've learned that I look forward to the day when future Filipinos have robot butlers that are white. That's I'm looking forward to that. So where will we deserve? Maybe, maybe robots. And also, Justin. Yeah. You do the best Katy Perry impression mm -hmm. ever. That's what my mom's told me. Yep. Your mom's right. Thank you. I'll call her tonight. All right. Brian, what have you learned? Learned that I really enjoy doing this show and imagining that Yuri Geller is forced to watch all of this. Oh, it's been mm. a great night. Yeah. A great Me too. Night. It's been a great I love that. Uh, shine on, you crazy great diamonds. Brian, you know I get so you low when you are not around. We can find oil, too. I guess I need some What's the other tagline? To turn my day we, we said great night and shine on, you crazy you diamonds. Know, like a girl right. that's a hero. No, you didn't. Come on. Right. Right. Oh, did you? I think we did, yeah. Uh, oh, Bryce, it, no, no, stop it, Jesus stop Christ. it. No, restart it. This restart no, it. No, no, this is it. Bryce ruined it. Bryce ruined it. No, Bryce ruined it. Oh, my God. Bryce ruined it. It's fine. Start the whole thing again. No, okay. you didn't say it. We did. Uh, go check the tapes. <laughs> Look at the pixels. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Shine on, you crazy diamonds. Another motherfucking gray eight night. Brian, you know I get so low when you are not around. I Brian is dancing around. No, you still do need to say it now. You didn't say it. Say what? You know, <laughs> the final deal. line. I already said it. No, no, we restarted. Oh, it. We shamed him. A a gray eight night. What? You need to say the last line now. The last line is. I'm, I'm pimping you to say it. He's doing b boy tricks. I'm having his heart beat out of his chest. Wow. Oh, he really cares. A lot. Yeah. A Luga. <laughs> Still a great night. You <laughs> can. Never been a great
greater night, a single bed, a later night, a pause, the masturbation night, a let's get drunk and laugh tonight. There's never been a greater, greater night. Diamond Club hopes you have enjoyed this program. <laughs>